All right, so what I'm doing here is just uh, making it easy for myself to record this uh, for uh, explaining what I think might be useful. I had this conversation with my one of my customers this morning in terms of how do we make the best of a bad situation and not having the OneNote tab. I gave some ideas that seemed to resonate with them. So basically wanted to show them that, you know, just because we don't have the OneNote tab doesn't mean we have to give up on OneNote within um, within Teams and GCC. So this is a GCC demo tenant. Um, you can see that I have notebooks that I am that are in the thread the chat thread that are, you know, there are conversations occurring with them. If I click it. I still get my OneNote notebook within Teams. It doesn't go out to its own separate no uh, tab, still get the chat there. Um, and, uh, you know, how do I get this? Uh, you know, if I go to file, I've got notebooks in here, I can open them. Um, I can hit the start conversation button to make them show up in the, in the uh, conversation thread. I can edit them and so forth. What I can't really do here is just easily make a new notebook. I mean, you can see there's no new there. And I can't, you know, with today's cloud notebooks, I can't upload one. So what I would do is go into sh the SharePoint site for it. And um, here in general, I can make a new notebook. Uh, create it. So I see it now, of course, I'm in my own, its own tab. I can see it, I can do stuff to it, you know. All good, all done. Go back. And I really can't get anything going in Teams here, so I got to come back to uh, Teams. And my new one is there. Uh, let's see, is that it? Yep, new one is there. I click it, it opens in Teams. I can start a conversation about it, which does put it in the chat window. And then I can now take this, get a link copy that, go up to, uh, I, you know, we only have a few in GCC. I could use Wiki. So I'll say OneNote uh, 5, save it. Call out, put all that, say that, make that say whatever, notebook. Um, link, paste it, insert. So now there's my OneNote 555. So if I go to that tab, one more click, and I'm opening the notebook within Teams. So again, not, not a link that takes me out to a new tab. I'm still in Teams. I still got all of this. I still get the conversation. I can still edit. Um, so, so very similar to the OneNote tab experience. So two clicks, and, you know, a bunch of other work. But uh, Maybe that's the best way to make uh, lemonade out of lemons, I think. Now, the, the caveat is there's a OneNote notebook that comes with the groups that we're in. You see that here. This is a group notebook. You can even see it here in the, in the um, SharePoint site. This, uh, where that actually lives is in the site assets folder. So if I go site contents, site assets, there's that folder or that notebook. T teams can't see this folder, so there's no good way to really bring this into that whole piece if someone is using the default notebook. I can easily do a move to and put it somewhere that Teams can access it, but once I do that, then this guy's, this link is broken, even though it's, that is, uh, oops, that's easily fixed. All right, I can edit and make this, you know, notebook be anything I want. But this link would be permanently broken, I think, by doing that move. So I don't know if anybody's even using these, but uh, that is one caveat is that's the one notebook, the one that comes with the group that would be affected by trying to integrate it in the teams in this way. But otherwise, any new ones that you create in any of these channels pretty much give you uh, a lot of decent, uh, decent functionality. So could be a you know a way to to combat the uh, issue people may have with the one note tab being gone. Let me know what you think. Just a uh, little brainstorm I had this morning. Let me know if you think that's a good way to approach it with our customers.